Niels. We're here at my office uh, of Carlo Vision in, in Utrecht. Yep. Uh, you're the co-founder of, uh, of Any Jobby. Yeah. So uh, what is it? So uh, Any Jobby is uh, an online community marketplace where um, uh, individuals can outsource small tasks and jobs uh, to uh, local people in the area who have the time and uh, the tools and the knowledge to perform those tasks. And so we connect them throughout our, our platform. Okay, cool. And, 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 and how did you get to the idea? So uh, it, it started when, uh, when I moved uh, to another uh, house, myself, relatively old house, uh, which there were many small things to do. We had problems with doors, uh, walls that needed to be painted. So um, I, I didn't want to, uh, to hire a professional because I don't have the money to pay him. And they, 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 yeah, they're just too expensive for me. So uh, what I thought, like maybe there's somebody in a neighbor around here that's willing to do those small tasks and jobs for just for, for, for a lot less, more, more for side job to get some extra, earn some extra cash. So why not connecting those people uh, yeah, f throughout the platform? That was my idea. And I proposed it to, to some people I know. Uh, somebody who was familiar with uh, 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 like programming and he thought the idea was amazing and uh, together we, we eventually built it to where it is right now. Okay, so, so and, 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 and where are you right now? So we started uh, in uh, the begin, uh, beginning of October 2015. So we're live for around six, six months uh, right now and uh, um, without any publicity or marketing, we have uh, around uh, 3,000 uh, unique visits. We had 3,000 unique visits and uh, around uh, 300 users and already completed uh, 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 more than 30 uh, jobs and tasks. Uh, all different kind of things from uh, uh, moving uh, somebody, help, um, helping somebody to move out to repairing stuff, uh, placing uh, a door, yeah. And how did you manage to get people on a platform? Uh, so uh, on the demand and also on the, on the supply yeah, side. Yeah, so uh, of course we we use uh, the the free publicity as much as possible. So um, uh, uh, social media as well. Uh, we had uh, an article in a newspaper, in a Dutch newspaper, uh, um, and and we really try to uh, communicate um, uh, through our own network that we're live, that we're starting, that, that you should post everything on our platform. So basically we, yeah, we shout out our name to everyone we know. That's basically it, yeah. And how was the first uh, match being made? And, 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 and what was it? Uh, uh, now I have to think, what was the first match? Uh, a, a historic moment, I yeah, guess. Yeah, yeah, of course. Uh, I think it was for, for me because uh, I needed, uh, on my bureau, I needed uh, some kind of, uh, uh, um, yeah, um, Thing. yeah, furniture uh, to uh, augment to place my monitor on it. So I placed mm. it on on my own platform, and there was a job who actually uh, uh, yeah made uh, uh, stuff out of wood furniture, and he wanted to do that for me. Um, and for thirty euros, he did it fine for me, and now I have uh, a beautiful stand for for my monitor. Okay, cool. Yeah pretty happy with it and I think if I would let it do by professional we would maybe ask twice or maybe above a hundred yeah yeah that's clear and 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 it you two are doing everything yourself so also the everything IT. yeah everything yeah that's that's run one of the most uh, uh, I think important things of our company everything is in-house we've created all the whole platform ourselves uh, front-end back-end everything design I, I learned teach myself to work in photoshop to that was not my background at all but yeah we we had to do something there we 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 used some um freelancers but it didn't work that out that good why not um yeah because uh, uh yeah we wanted to uh when they delivered the work the their yeah, there were still changes that needed to be made. And again, going to them and ask them was, this process was so yeah, time consuming. And also with, uh, uh, with the compensation, yeah, when do you pay extra for what amount of work was, yeah, was just an obstacle. So eventually I started to learn myself to work in Photoshop and 
uh, uh, designed uh, uh, many parts of the, the website myself and together with my uh, co-founder, uh, yeah, we're a great team to, yeah, we have all the skills in house. Yeah, and, and when we talk about uh, Joby, because your name is, 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 uh, is Ellen Joby. Yeah. Uh, 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 a Joby can be a lot, I guess. Everything, so, 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 yeah. so what kind of things are people doing on your platform? Uh, yeah, can be everything. That's what we say, uh, what, what we communicate. A Joby can be, ev uh, can be everything. For example, um, there where there was a woman that needed their uh, garden to be, um, yeah, the, the 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 trees needed to be uh, say, cut cut, yeah. cut, yeah, and uh, nice haircut, yeah, and, uh, nice garden cut, uh, helping to people move out because uh, they didn't had a van or didn't want somebody to to hire. They needed somebody to carry the heavy stuff. Um, uh, yeah, rep uh, handyman jobs, uh, repairing a door, uh, even somebody wanted to uh, have uh, an apple pie baked for his birthday. Uh, yeah, it can be everything. Okay, yeah. um, interesting. Yeah. Uh, but also interesting because you see uh, with, with, with this kind of t platforms, you see uh, platforms who are starting in a niche, like yeah. with, with, uh, with cleaning, yeah. Yeah, we all know a help link. Yeah. And I also uh, ask the guys help link, okay, are you also going to expand in your services? They say, okay, but of course, because else we uh, we we uh, we uh, would have named the uh, the platform clean link. Yeah. Clean link. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. so they start with a niche uh, and then comes uh, uh, behind the door of people's homes. Yeah. And from there they expand. But your strategy is okay. We're going yeah. to start broad, broad from yeah. the first day. Yeah. I think we're doing that. We're doing that on purpose, and um, we eventually hope to see that maybe um, there will be a, a part of the business that uh, is more profitable, and then focus on that one so for example is if we're seeing that IT jobbies are the ones that uh, are being posted most frequently mm -hmm. then I think we're going to maybe um, yeah focus a, a bit more on, on that side but if we see the um, garden jobbies that are more uh, there's more demand for those uh, jobbies then we're saying maybe we can go that direction yeah. but for now on purpose we we're having this broad skill so people can uh, yeah, post anything actually. Yeah, yeah, because I think also uh, with different skills, see, there are also uh, different uh, demands on, on 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 the way how you how you communicate. Yeah. I guess uh, yeah. like when uh, you, you talk about the 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 design freelancers, yeah, you, you can also hire them uh, through any job. Of course you can. Um, yeah. But I but I think they need a complete different approach. Uh, yeah. Approach. Yeah. Of, uh, not only in in communication marketing, but also in in uh, in the workflow. Yeah. Then uh, like a, a cleaner or a, of course, a guy yeah. who, who uh, repairs yeah. the door. Yeah, that, that's true. So then you have to yeah you have to customize uh, your platform for that, tailor it, and communicate different messages. Yeah. yeah. So you you yeah you have to make decisions in that. Yeah. yeah. So there's possibly that, that, that we have in the future because you're live only now for a couple of months. So so it's quite quite young now. But yeah. in the future there will always also be a itjobby.com a Garden Jabby, that's possible. Um, yeah. possible. Maybe we should get those uh, <laughs> domain names uh, already before. I think uh, you get one day before the video is live, yeah. so good luck with that. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Yeah. Yeah, but I think it's, it's yeah, because they, they also need a, a different approach. Yeah. Uh, but I think it's really good to build the, the Adin Jabby brand yeah. uh, uh, above that. Yeah, it is. Yeah. And, and, and um, what are your biggest challenges right now? Because you say, okay, uh, we got some demand and, and, and supply. Yeah. So, so, so uh, what do you need more, demand or supply? So for us, it's the, the, the demand side. So we really need, uh, we're, we're also focusing on people posting jobbies because our philosophy is that uh, jobbers will eventually come. It's what we're also seeing in our data is that uh, we have over 30, 40 jobbers, uh, so which is a huge percentage compared to the, 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 the normal uh, users. So they will come. So we're focusing really on the demand side. Mm -hmm. Having as many jobbies posted as possible, and eventually, um, yeah, um, one jobber can also complete more jobbies. So, and 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 how do you maintain quality? So so like uh, when I want to subscribe uh, as a jobber, yeah, uh, and I say okay, I can uh, build kitchens, mm -hmm. but, but I can't. Yeah. So how how do you check the skills and how do you maintain the quality for the supply side? Uh, so, uh, first of all, you, as a jobber, you, you can uh, verify yourself on different uh, points. Uh, like? Uh, yeah, so the social media uh, uh, 
uh, verification points we have. We have uh, um, ID, can, we can do an ID check. Uh, your phone number, of course, is important. That's, that's obligated for Jobber because we want to call them as well and know the people behind them. And mm -hmm. especially in the beginning, it's very important that we know where Jobbers are. So, uh, and then we talk with them, what, what have they done before, what are they doing currently, and uh, yeah, that's, that's how we, in the beginning we are maintaining this uh, trust and building uh, and, and ensuring uh, uh, quality. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah so, you... for example, I, I spoke a jobber last week and it was, uh, he, was, uh, uh, he just uh, finished with his, his uh, job, uh, he's in... in um, he, uh, he's 67 years old right mm -hmm. now, so, 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 so he's uh, retired. Retired, thanks. I was searching for that word. Uh, but he worked 35 years uh, at a at a at a business, uh, Stukadors bedrijf, mm -hmm. and uh, so he was pretty good. Uh, he had a lot of experience, and uh, so that for us ensures uh, that it's somebody who, who offers quality and mm -hmm. knows what he's doing. Yeah. So. And, and, and what is the average amount spent on, on the platform? So we now, if we look at what, what has, has been completed, then we're talking about an average of 80 euros to 90 euros. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And, and what about taxes? Uh, because normally when you hire a professional, uh, the uh, it uh, has to be a number of the, of the, of the Chamber of Commerce, has to yeah. uh, pay VAT, uh, yeah. house tax, uh, included in your system? So, so we, uh, of course, we as a company pay our taxes ourselves. That's, of course, it's, we're obligated to do. But um, we also communicate to uh, our jobbers, uh, like we offer you uh, the possibility to earn extra cash, but you're, you're responsible for uh, uh, yeah, doing your own taxes. Um, and there is this uh, there is this rule that you have the uh, possibility to work 18 hours a week in the uh, uh, hobby area to do to earn extra cash in that area. So it's allowed. We're really focusing on this rule, uh, but that you have to uh, uh, yeah you have to do your taxes and mention that you have earned that amount of money extra cash within this. Uh, area. Yeah, okay, yeah. interesting. Uh, can you send me the link so I also share it? Uh, sure, no problem. Uh, below the video. Yeah, I think it's a really interesting uh, uh, thing. And uh, what about insurance? Because, yeah, uh, things can go wrong. Maybe yeah. not right now, but in the end, uh, one day something yeah. will go wrong. Yeah. So we've been, um, yeah, we've been researching that a lot. Um, at this point, we we cannot offer any kind of insurance, but we're looking and talking with uh, insurance company. Uh, who are, uh, uh, yeah, maybe are interested to, to, uh, to, to help us uh, and, and see a future in this economy. Uh, so for now, what we're communicating is that we're only the, 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 the platform uh, connecting uh, each, uh, the two parties. Mm -hmm. um, so, and, and if there is, if there is anything wrong or there's any, uh, 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 yeah, Damage. And, yeah, damage. Then, um, yeah, we're, we we we're not in a process yet. We want to offer that, but our, we cannot do that. Yeah, yet. yeah, it's a really interesting uh, yeah thing. So what you say? Okay, uh, we're only bringing together demand and supply, yeah. and the end uh, demand and supply they're responsible yeah uh, for these uh, these issues. Yeah, Th that's exactly what we're doing. But we want to uh, eventually offer more than that because I think. We can, um, and it's also important for 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 this for our platform that we can offer these kind of things. Yeah, yeah, I also, think you really add a really much more more value. value yeah, your, yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah, and and and, and more about trust. Uh, um, uh, are people uh, also rating each other uh, yeah. after the job done? Yeah, that's one of the most important parts of of our platform is the the review uh, feature that we have. Is uh, after you. Uh, yeah, your the jobber you have hired completed is is jobby. Uh, you uh, are yeah you are uh, obligated to give him a review. Really, yeah. we find that so is they, uh, a a two sided review. So so no, okay. It's only the the, the jobber is the only person that receives a review, okay. and uh, uh, yeah the. the in the beginning, to, to start it off, it's, it's really difficult where we've experienced that and we are still experiencing that. But 
uh, in the end, we hope that this feature is, yeah, that, that, that so many reviews have been given that it will go automatically that people will tr trust other jobbers based on what others have said about yeah, them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think also with helping, they say they also uh, are asking a, 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 a couple of, of uh, references from the past uh, to, to, to get a reference. So, so when I knew a helpling cleaner, or in your uh, case, a, a new uh, jobber starts, yeah. that you already have some reviews from uh, jobs from the from the past. From the past, so maybe yeah. It's also an yeah, idea. yeah, yeah, yeah. We we have thought about that feature that jobbers can uh, upload their CV or something. Uh, yeah, we're looking at that feature because, of course, it, it will be very difficult for somebody uh, for for somebody want to perform. Uh, jobbies on our platform and there are so many of them already to compete with those mm. that already have uh, an average of four and a half stars and then uh, you, you will never be selected yeah in a yeah. figure of speech so. yeah so it's really hard then to, to start of with. Course. because you uh, do also your 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 clients or the people uh, who are uh, posting jobs mm -hmm. uh, really requests about these reviews or or do you think it's important for them uh, I mean, request about the. Uh, yeah. Uh, do you receive also in the in the in the decision process like when they have uh, three jobbers they can choose from, and there's one with yeah. uh, uh, three ratings yeah. and and one with zero yeah. ratings? Do you see that they yeah, yeah. really pick? The, yeah, uh, the they three. value the one more that already has a, a track record. Yeah. yeah, I think that's human and yeah, it, it's normal because uh, yeah, you can see what you've done uh, has done before and. That just trust is is very important in this uh, in 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 the start of this business and in this economy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and 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 you're now mainly focused, I guess, uh, in the region of of uh, of, uh, of Leiden, yeah. in the Netherlands. Yeah. Um, so, what is your growth strategy? So we want to start uh, locally, so really build a community in in Leiden itself, and. Eventually, uh, if if we uh, uh, yeah if this community is is big enough, we want to expand to uh, yeah c cities uh, 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 yeah near Leiden, so uh, the Hague, uh, Rotterdam, Delft, uh, Utrecht. Uh, All from the Rhine, where I come from. <laughs> yeah, yeah, of course, yeah. Also, of course, we we don't neglect those small communities because those are I think the the ones that will be. Uh, most valuable and where a community is created faster than maybe in the bigger cities but uh, yeah that's actually the strategy and I think also when you look at this uh, this this model uh, you, you have to build it locally and then expand like uh, like an oil uh, yeah 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 I think it's really interesting because uh, the transaction is really local so in the end you really have to build on a really strong national brands absolutely but it yeah. really has to to focus on on the local yeah. uh, growth yeah. because every city you have to start over again almost. Abs absolutely yeah. yeah yeah that's true yeah so we we eventually hope to have a like a, a strategy in in uh in in Leiden that works and that we can copy and then do in the other cities so yeah, yeah. and then yeah. we also know the the impact maybe the amount of money we need for for it yeah and and is there a lot of competition in the markets uh, in the Netherlands, not not that big. Uh, we, we see in, in other countries that there are some really major players uh, like dominating the market. But in the Netherlands, there's still uh, some parties that are uh, yeah searching for okay, what do we want? Where do we want to focus on? How how actually are people? Do they like this economy? This this kind of business? Uh, so I think there's not, yeah, there are some players, but there's not one dominant one yet. Yeah, so there's enough space for you to grow. Uh, yeah, to, that's, uh, to why, grow. that's why I started this. I'm yeah, doing this uh, eventually and then die slowly. You know? yeah, yeah, sure, of course. And, and, and what are your biggest challenges in, 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 the, in, in growing? So, so, so what are the, the things yeah, uh, you have to make decisions about uh, uh, for, for your next steps? Yeah, uh, I think the, the 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 most important one is uh, we we need funding. We need uh, to grow. Uh, yeah, you have to expose yourself, get people to know your brand, get mm -hmm. people to know your your company. So our next step is to uh, to 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 get an investor or more investors to to help us. Uh, 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 yeah, grow and then especially in uh, in Leiden in the beginning, but eventually grow further in in the Netherlands uh, yeah that, that's uh, f f our growth growth strategy for now and uh, 
also when you look what we have done we've really bootstrapped this at the whole beginning and it really um yeah the proof of concept is there and now it's all about money yeah and uh, you say okay uh, when you look at the competition uh, there are some 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 other players in the mm -hmm. market uh, but do you also uh, are looking to the more niche comp competitors who are uh, saying okay we're only focusing on, on cleaners on, on yeah. shoppers on no no not really no just really those companies that are really focusing on the things we're doing as well like this broad view this broad uh uh yeah this this broad a uh, group of 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 jobs that can be done that's the one where yeah those companies were focusing on them as well so yeah and and and, and what kind of partners are you also talking to or looking for uh, for your growth, uh, the first one is is, is a partner with uh, with money investors. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, are there also some different other partners you are looking for uh, to also accelerate your growth? Uh, insurance company, uh, because uh, trust and insurance is one of the main uh, obstacles for for people to uh, uh, yeah not use our platform. We we see that. Uh, so if we could get an insurance company aboard then that would really uh would really benefit of that uh i think uh secondly uh uh maybe a partnership with with a, a big brand la like uh uh proxies gamma yeah the mm -hmm. where our uh, our target group is really present to work with them but what we're seeing is, uh, yeah, we're operating in a relatively uh, new market. So they're also a little bit uh, maybe afraid of what will happen in, in this economy. So yeah. it's it's a natural reaction, yeah. but... Uh, yeah, so that's also like a, a kind of a, a, a chicken-egg dilemma. Exactly, yeah. The chicken-egg dilemma, we have plenty of them at, at our company. Yeah, yeah me too. <laughs> yeah. And are you also thinking about uh, international expansion to other countries? Eventually, yeah, of course. If 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 we're done in the Netherlands, I think uh, 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 an easy next step is to go to Germany or, or Belgium. Yeah, of yeah. course. Yeah, yeah, yeah interesting. Yeah. And, and 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 what are your big big dreams? So let's say we we talk again in five years. Mm -hmm. What would be the idea, the ideal situation where you're then in? Uh, so I would say that uh, we we are. Uh, the number one player in the Netherlands. We have uh, covered, I think, most part of Europe. So the 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 the, 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 the countries uh, pretty similar to the Netherlands. So Germany, Belgium. I think more in Europe, a known brand, and uh, yeah, a user amount of in millions. Uh, yeah, of course, maybe like like blah blah car where blah blah car is right now. That's where we would like to be in five years, of course. So, so then you get a 1.2 billion validation? Uh, and, at uh, least, yeah. At least. at least. Okay, yeah. cool. But I think that's everybody's dream. Huh? Yeah. That's why you started. Okay, great. So yeah. I wish you all the luck. Thanks uh, for the interview. Yeah. And uh, talk to me in five years yeah. in your new office. Yeah, of course. <laughs> great. In Paris. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> <laughs>